There's the mindset for success. And this is grit, this is perseverance, this is hustle, this is grind, right? And then you've got on the opposite end of the spectrum, the mindset for happiness, which is letting go, breathing, relaxing, accepting life, you know, oh, <laughs> right? And this is like two opposite end of the spectrum, uh, which leads me to the question, is it possible to be successful and happy at the same time. Mother. Mother. Sucker. Honestly, I don't know, but I have a theory. I've always said in order to be happy, you have to be grateful. You can't be grateful and unhappy at the same time, right? And in terms of success, success is a, it's a tricky thing because would you call yourself successful if you had all the ex external metrics for success? Uh, but you feel dead inside. On the other end of the spectrum, would you call yourself successful if you felt good, you felt great, but you had nothing to show for it? Huh? So I guess it depends what you call a success, but I'm just gonna use the traditional uh, external metrics for success as success, uh, like achievement of goals, etc., etc. In order to have success uh, by that definition, discipline is the answer to that. So discipline and grateful is the key to success and happiness. So to the original question, in order for success and happiness, you can, you, can, you can be disciplined and grateful at the same time. You can train yourself to have both of these traits so you can be successful and happy at the same time, right? And the key, key thing, the beautiful thing about happiness is that <clears throat> it's a choice, it's internal choice. There's a concept in psychology, it's called hedonic treadmill, which is when people experience a massive high or a massive low, they eventually uh, return to the stable level of happiness, uh, which means, which demonstrates that happiness is not something that's determined by external circumstances, but instead it's something that's determined by internal circumstances. And like I said earlier, gratitude is the key to happiness because you can't be unhappy and grateful at the same time. So you can train your body, your mind to be more attentive to gratefulness. You can train your body to be more grateful. And the beautiful thing about grateful or gratitude is that no matter what situation or circumstance you happen to be in in life, you can always be grateful. There's always something to be grateful for. So you don't have to pretend to be grateful. There's, you, you can't fake it. You can be more, it's easy. It's an easy emotion to embody because there's always something to be grateful for. And uh, if you can manage to be grateful whilst you pursue your goals, uh, it actually makes it easier for you to achieve your goals because you're in uh, vibrational alignment, emotional alignment with your goals in the first place and this makes it easy for you to attract certain circumstances to you. So that's the beautiful thing about gratefulness, is that you can train yourself to be grateful, which in turn trains yourself to be happy, and which leads me to the conclusion that it is possible to be happy and successful at the same time. So that's it for today. I will see you again tomorrow. Uh, I just want to say thank you for watching the video. I hope you benefit from the information that I've just shared with you. If you like the video or the content, make sure to subscribe. I'm healthy. I'm grateful, I'm abundance, I am Fiala Sova, out.